boys welcome back to the second channel welcome back to cfm today we start a 1600 legendary roster cfm i of course am using the raiders and i'm going to take you through our roster right now basically everybody has five ability players on offense five ability player players on defense all the rosters are relatively similar and we're using the best he is glitching on my team they want me to lose already we're using the best players of all time from each franchise and for the Raiders, we're starting with our quarterback, Derek Carr. We would have been using Ken Stabler, but there's a glitch where the hidden dev doesn't get the right abilities and stuff. So Derek Carr is getting our X Factor. He's our starter, 93 overall. We also got Tim Brown, Bo Jackson, Fred Bolitnikoff, Dave Casper. And uh, that rounds out our offense, really. Bo Jackson's probably the best player on our entire team. However, I don't like to run the ball. So we're going to try to get Bo Jackson involved in the pass game as much as possible. He's got no abilities, and we're just going to see how he plays. That also doesn't really look like Bo Jackson. I feel like for such a legendary player, they could have got a better face scan. But uh, I guess this is the guy subbing in for Bo Jackson today. Can the, can the game stop glitching out? We got Gene Upshaw with Secure Protector. We got Colton Miller with Secure Protector at tackle. And we got uh, James Otto at center, 97 overall. Pretty good offense, I'd say. All right, Derek Carr, you're going to lead us to the promised land. Now let's take a look at the defense. Jack Tatum, superstar at safety. Jonathan Abram. Superstar at safety. Again, there's a little bit of a glitch, so we had to upgrade Jonathan Abram in order to get our ability to players. At safety, we're going deep route KO, deep out zone KO. No pick artist, which I'm a little bit scared about. Uh, we got Lester Hayes with deep out zone KO and pick artist. We got Namdi Asmoa with deep out zone KO and pick artist. And then Trayvon Merrick has flat zone KO. He doesn't get pick artist, unfortunately. Uh, this was going to be our user, but now that he doesn't get pick artist, I don't know what the hell we're going to do. But this is our roster. I feel like it's pretty good. Um, our pass rushers are going to be Khalil Mack, uh, Alzado, and Ted Hendricks. Those are going to be the... Oh, actually, shit. Howie Long. We got to go Howie Long. We're going to go Khalil Mack, Alzado, Howie Long. That's going to be our three pass rushers right there. All right. Defense looking good. Offense looking good. I'm excited for Derek Carr. Let's get into it, man. And week one of this CFM, we are going to be playing the Chargers. Again, it says they're an 88 overall. It says we're an 89 overall. So the teams are relatively even. Uh, and I'm going to take a look at his roster here in a minute. All right, boys. So the Chargers are led by Justin Herbert. Herbert's a higher overall than Philip Rivers, which is a little crazy, but you know, I'll give it to Herbert. 94 overall X factor. He's got LaDainian Thompson, 99 overall at running back. Me personally, I think Bo Jackson's better than LT. Sorry, maybe I'm maybe I'm biased, maybe I'm crazy, I don't know. But uh, LT is going to be the one we got to watch out for mainly on the offense. Lance Allworth, 92 speed. Charlie Joyner, 93 speed. And Keenan Allen, 88 speed. He's got Antonio Gates, 96 overall tight end. Only 86 speed, though. And Antonio Gates, believe it or not, has the exact same face scan as Bo Jackson. Apparently, Antonio Gates and Bo Jackson, identical twins. I didn't know that until today. Uh, let's take a look at his cornerbacks. He's got Antonio Cromartie, of course. Uh, Casey Hayward and Derwin James out there. Uh, very interesting. Jason Verrett at free safety. Again, interesting call. And Eric Waddle at strong safety. I like the Chargers team, but I fucking hate the Chargers franchise. So my opponent on Antonio Gates has Route Tech and Deep in Elite. I'm not sure why he's Deep in Elite. Route Tech obviously going to be something we need to watch out for. Herbert's got Slinger, Hot Rod Master, Protected, Pass Lead, Lead, and Fearless. Same abilities as me. Uh, Derwin James with Acrobat and Deep Out Zone KO. Eric Waddle, Pick Artist, Deep Out Zone KO. Allworth, Shorten, and Deep Out Elite. Cromartie has Acrobat, Deep Out Zone. Leslie O'Neill, Double or Nothing, Inside Stuff. That's going to be interesting. Uh, that's a defensive end, so our Secure Protector should pick that up. Charlie Joyner, Shorten, and Midden. Keenan Allen, Shorten, and Slotomatic. Corey Lindsley with Secure Protector and Threat Detector. And Casey Hayward with Mid Zone KO and Deep Out Zone KO. So he's got one, two, three, Four. So he's got four deep out zone KOs. So it's probably going to be four quarters of his defense. Team looks pretty solid. Uh, interesting ability choices, and we'll see how we play, man. All right, boys. Week one, we're going against Domo Don't Trust. He's the Chargers. This is going to be, obviously, one of our interdivision rivals. We're going to play him twice on the season. And uh, let's see how we play, man. Week one, let's start off this season hot. So I'm really excited to use Derek Carr. It's, it's very rare I get to use Derek Carr and Madden. Uh, he's never very good. But right now, he's fucking amazing. So it looks like my opponent is is uh, pressing, obviously. And looks like a blitz. All right, so we're going to block our running back here. Uh, I think he just shaded maybe inside. We're going to block our running back, try to pick up this outside pressure. And we're going to be looking for Bolitnikov on the outside. That's where we're looking. Bolitnikov was absolutely not open. So we had to check it down to Dave Casper. Now, I will say his user was right there. That was an irresponsible throw. Could have been intercepted, 
and I'm grateful it wasn't. Um, we're going to go with slot out right here. We're going to be looking on the right sideline if we can get a little bit of time. We're not going to get any time. There's Bo Jackson, huh? Why is Marcus Allen in? Get Marcus Allen off the field. We need Bo Jackson in this bitch. So my opponent's been sitting in a cover two. He's been running a cover two defense. We're going to try to pick up this edge defender right here. We're going to go... We're going to go right there. I mean, Jesus Christ, Dave Casper. Way to get wide open. That's not the receiver I wanted to throw to. All right, but we'll take the first down. All right, now we got Bo in the backfield. All right, if this is a zone coverage look, we're going to Bo Jackson immediately. It was absolutely not zone coverage. Hey, good catch, Dave. Dave Casper's been our, our guy so far. My opponent's running some pretty interesting defense, man. I, I feel like um, I feel like I'm not really sure what to expect on any given play. And there's Derek Carr walking into a sack, as always. Third and 15 here. We did have the, the read we wanted. All right, boys, we're looking over the middle. High-low read, either the slant or the post. Looks like the post is there. We, we, we lagged a little bit on the throw, but Tim Brown makes the catch. We're inside the 10-yard line, man. And this is where our guy Bo Jackson comes into play. You know what they say? Bo fucking knows. Give him a stretch to the right, and Bo Jackson, go make him pay. You didn't make him pay, Bo. You actually lost four fucking yards, actually. So that's insane. Now, we're going to motion Tim Brown over to the left, but we are still running it to the right here. Going to try to throw him off a little bit. Can we pick up a block, please? Bo Jackson, if you can't break a tackle, what can you do? Right? What's the point of Bo Jackson if he's not breaking tackles? I think we might try to go Fred Casper in the flats if we can. That was stupid. That didn't work. Guys, do we go for this? I think we got to go for this. Fourth and goal from the five. I think we have no choice. All right. Looks like he's blitzing off the left side here. We're going to slide left. He's been running nothing but man coverage. So we are looking at either Branch or Bolitnikov. That's what we're looking for. I deserve that. I deserve that. He switched it to his own coverage. That was good defense by my opponent. As mad as I am, we didn't get good defense to my opponent. And there's the run on first down. All right. We're going to have to play uh, solid defense here now that we didn't score any points on our opening drive. I'm actually incredibly sad about that. I want to start off the season right with Derek Carr throwing a touchdown. But sadly, uh, obviously, that didn't work the way we planned. That's, that's wide open, isn't it? No, it's not. All right, boys. Third and seven. This is where we could potentially get off the field. I don't know if he would punt it if he doesn't get it. But let's go ahead and find out. Let's put him in a fourth and a million. Motion blocks there. We're coming underneath. Everything should be bagged. Everything should be bagged. Everything should be bagged. That shouldn't be fucking open. That shouldn't be open. We got 17 guys over there. There's the run on first and 10. Stuffed again. Come on, baby. That's a big hit. Charlie Joyner ain't got shit on us. We're going to run cloud flats on the outside. At least I thought we were. Oh, that should be picked. Fourth down and four. What does he do? Let's find out. Why was he wide open? How does he get wide open on a drag? Where's the man coverage? Where's the effort? We are getting dotted alive here, boys. This up-tempo offense is killing me. Oh, we were almost there. We almost got outside of that to get the interception. We were so close, but so far. Got to be a little bit more quick with our user. Oh, no. Again, the quick hike. Yo, look at LaDainian Thompson. See, if Bo Jackson can break tackles like that, we might have scored on our last drive. But Bo Jackson doesn't want to do that. Bo Jackson wants to get shown up like a little cuck boy. Yo, this man is dotting our shit, boys. 45 seconds. I feel like it might be time to almost call a timeout. I think I got to call a timeout. There's the running attempt again. Again, not much there. But the problem is I'm, not, I'm definitely not getting the ball back now. Well, no more timeouts for me. Um, yeah, this is the last drive of the half, man. This, this is the last drive of the half, unfortunately. All right, first and 10. There's another running attempt. And can we just make a damn tackle, boys? I mean, come on. Make a damn tackle. Brother, how could you even hike the ball that fast? I didn't even know it was possible to hike the ball that fast. Brother, how can you hike the ball that fast? I did not know that was fucking possible. All right, boys. First and goal from the two. I mean, he's, he's definitely looking to get in here. Somebody get in there. Make a tackle. Come on. Two seconds. Is he going to go for it here at the end of half or is he going to kick three? I feel like he might kick three. He is. But, hey, good goal line stand, boys. Good goal line stand. We didn't give up seven. We didn't We didn't give up seven. That's what I'm happy about. I had, yeah, one second to get to the line. 
and snap the ball. This dude hurried the fuck up and, and snapped the ball before I could even breathe. I fucked up. I don't know what the hell I called. You got a million things wide open. Yeah, that, that should be that should be caught every time. I have no idea what the hell I just called. Defense was out of whack right there. PA slot cross, of course. Sitting here at the line. There, Yeah, there it is. There's the run game like I talked about. You know, if we could just make a damn tackle, I'd be really happy. 11 rushes, 38 yards. Fucking hell. In a, in a Madden game. He had 10 rushing attempts on his opening drive, which is fucking crazy. All right. There's the passing attempt we've been waiting on. They, uh, you know what? I would have loved a sack. I would have loved a sack. Brother, I can't even breathe out here. We're, we're just quick snapping inside zone over and over and over again. I can't even breathe out here. Dude, I can't even breathe out here. That's got to be played. Come on. Where the fuck are we, man? We can't just keep quick snapping PA slot cross and letting it fucking work. And here's going to come the running attempt. I promise you. There it is. Jesus Christ, dude. Can I get a little break somewhere? Can I get something, please? Why is he not backing up, bro? I couldn't get on my user, bro. My, my DB wouldn't back off and he was gonna get ran by. I had to back him off manually. That's, that's terrible. I mean, I, I would have for sure had him back there and been using that. That's awful. Here comes the running attempt. I'm gonna run commit up the middle. I'm already knowing this. Like, I mean, no surprises there. 15 rushes in, in two drives is insane. Can we get a pick? Please. He's taking up the whole goddamn half. I've touched the ball once. I've had one offensive drive. I hate this guy. I hate him. I hate him. How, dude? I'm going to lose my shit. I'm going to lose my shit so hard. I'm going to lose my shit so hard because I was on that. I'm losing my shit. Keep it pushing. We got to score quick, man. We got to score quick. My second time having the ball, we got to get in the end zone like now. We got to be there right now. Hike the ball, please. Go, go, go. You know, Derek Carr, I had an open receiver. You didn't hit him. That was your fault, Derek, not mine. My opponent is actually a, psych a fucking psychopath. Like, and I can't even hike the fucking ball. This is not what I want. This is not the play. I want. This is not what I want. I can't even do anything. I can't snap the ball. I can't do nothing. That's not what I wanted. I tried to motion like him. It didn't work. I don't think he's blitzing. I don't think he's blitzing. I mean, Jesus Christ! Thank God we converted that, man. I mean, that was ugly. This is ugly. All right, we get in the end zone here. We're going to be okay. We're going to still have to get a stop. But, like, man, this has been an ugly game. How is he not open? How did my tight end not get open at all? Right, we're not blocking anybody else if he blitzes here. Of course he did. Of course he fucking did. Of course he did. Of course he did. All right, two-minute warning, boys. Third and 24. We're fucked. If we have to kick three, we will. I mean, my God. I don't know how post gets bagged by man coverage. I really don't, man. I really don't. That's going to do it, boys. That's going to do it. Jesus Christ. Yeah, so we're going to have to play a little differently in this in this CFM, it seems. I, I I mean, if the clock is... So accelerated clock is on. Yeah, 40-second play clock. We should have done 30-second play clock. I think we should have done 30-second play clock, not 40-second. I should have kicked three right now. All right, we're going to spike it and just kick three, I think. Actually, no. We'll, we'll, we'll see if we can get the onside kick. We'll go for seven here. How about you catch it, Darren Waller? What the fuck, man? He's got no abilities or nothing. How about you catch it? We got to get an onside kick anyways. We got to get an onside kick anyways. We'll try our best. I will say this, guys. Most of the time, my opponent's not going to run halfback base 19 times in a game. Like, I'm playing a guy who's a little bit weird. And so most of the time, that's not going to be the issue. Most of the time, that's not going to be the issue. <laughs> GG's to my opponent, man. Terrible start to the season. Um, I didn't know he was going to chew the clock so much. I would have been a little bit more conservative I, if I knew. Um, but now we know. The games can easily fly by with the 40-second play clock. All right? We got 
Halfback base called on us fucking 20 times in, in, in one game. That's a terrible start to the season. Week two! Week one was fucking pitiful. That shit was awful. Week two, we're playing against the Cardinals. All right, he's 0-1 as well. So, you know, maybe we'll have better luck in week two. I hope so. All right, we're going to take a look at his roster right now, see what he's rocking with. You guys know our team. Uh, I feel like in week one, our team did not perform very well. Bo Jackson, I'm looking at you. We had a touchdown opportunity that you fucked up. Kyler Murray is his quarterback for the Cardinals. He's got 94 overall, going to be an X factor, uh, most likely. Larry Centers at halfback 90 overall. His wide receivers are Larry Fitzgerald, who is a 95 overall. David Boston and Anquan Bolden. All right, an interesting, uh, interesting group there. I I'm surprised... I mean, I guess I don't know who would replace David Boston. I was going to say, I'm surprised David Boston made the cut, but I'm not sure who else would be there. Jackie Smith at tight end. Take a look at his defensive backs. He's got Anus Williams, Patrick Peterson, and Byron Murphy Jr. Patrick Peterson, one of the best corners in the game. Larry Wilson at free safety. We love Larry Wilson. And then Buda Baker at strong safety. So a pretty good team overall. You can see some of his players are downgraded because of the demoralizing week one loss. I think my players are doing the same. All right. My opponent on Patrick Peterson is deep route KO, inside shade. He's got short in and short out on Larry. He's got all the good abilities on Kyler. He's got inside shade on Byron Murphy. Christian Kirk has short in. Buda Baker with medium route and deep route KO. Secure protector on Dan. Larry Wilson with deep route KO and pick artist. Jackie Smith, short in, elite, and red zone threat. Rodney Hudson, secure protector post up. And Chandler Jones, double or nothing inside stuff. So it's looking like he's going to be running man coverage. We're expecting full man coverage this game based on his abilities. Uh, we do have man-beating abilities, so that shouldn't be a, a too big of an issue for us. And hopefully we can get our first win of the season, man, because we can't go 0-2. Absolutely not. All right, first and 10. This is what our this is what our defense is looking like here. We got nothing down the middle. We're blitzing one off the right side. The slots are manned up. Larry Fitz is the one manned up. On the outside, he's got Christian Kirk. I might want to back off Lester Hayes just so he doesn't get beat deep. We're going to see what Kyler Murray's got for us. All right, boys, there's a slant post. Slant post. There we go. Great defense all around. I really like the way that looked. I'm a big fan of that defense right there. I'm such a big fan of that defense. We're going to give it to him again. All right, second and 10. This is what our D is looking like. Not exactly the same, but it looks pretty similar. We're going to pass commit. Looks like my opponent's dialing up some hot routes. Corner route. I knew it. Pick it off, 35! You piece of shit! All right, boys, this is what our defense looks like. We're going to help out on the right side flat. Anything coming right to left, we're going to have to help with as well. All right, but I like, again, the way the defense looked. All right, we're, we're going straight to the right to start. Uh-oh, post. Yep, good good dot, man. Good dot. I thought he was going corner out. I didn't think he would go post. That's a great dot right there for my opponent. All right, there's the first run of the day. It's a counter. All right, if he was an inside zone, he might have got a little bit more yards, but... Loses one on the counter. All right, this is what we got on the field here. Second and 11. He's probably going to a corner route of some kind. All right, I don't know if he's going to go with the, the seams corner. Going to the running back. Man, we couldn't get out there in time. I, I feel like I saw it pretty early on. I ran straight out there. Could not get to the running back in time. Third and five. All right, he is back in tight again. Tight offset, tight end. I wouldn't be surprised if we saw an 0-1 trap right here. We're running a simple cover four with hard flats on the outside, all right? We're not doing anything crazy. We're gonna help over the middle. That's gotta be us, 40. And it's overthrown. There's the fourth down. And this is the first big down of the game. All right, we got a cover three shell on the right. We got man coverage on the left. We're gonna be helping over the middle. I, I really like this defense right here. I feel like we cannot be beat on this defense. All right, we got flat zone KO as well on our hard flats. So anything out there should be hit loose. And uh, I wouldn't be surprised if he went to like some type of C route maybe. That's gotta... Man, why why can't we catch a break, dude? Why can't we catch a break? All right, there's a run on the next play after the, the rough fourth down conversion. Man, we can't catch a break in Madden. Madden fucking hates us, bro. No, I didn't get anything set up. I didn't get anything set up, but neither did he. All right, he didn't pick up the pressure. Third and eight. Maybe we get off the field now. Let's find out. All right, boys, third and eight. We're still looking for our first turnover of the season in week two. Uh, first quarter's almost up, so hopefully we get a turnover here. Let's find out. He's motion over Rondale Moore. We're gonna have to watch him if he goes deep. We're watching Rondale. We're watching Rondale. We're on Rondale. We're on Rondale. We're on Rondale. He is so much faster than us. I was trying to run with that man. We did not stand a chance. He is way faster than us. We get him in a fourth and eight, and he's gonna kick three. So again, no turnovers on the season. My opponent walking away from his first drive with likely three points here. Kick is up and good. 
And now can we get our first touchdown of the season? We're looking for the first touchdown of the season still. So like we said, we know that we're going to be getting... Uh, you're, you should start Henry Ruggs. Oh my God, I forgot about Henry Ruggs. Oh my God, I forgot about Henry Ruggs. We do have Henry Ruggs. I forgot about that, chat. Uh, that would have helped us in the last game. So like I said, we know we're getting man coverage here. We're going to start with something simple here. All right, just, just a little something like this. All right, we're just going to hike it. He's running spinner. There's our guy Casper underneath. And Dave Casper maybe gets a first down. Second and in inches. Doesn't look like Spinner because it's base aligned, but. But I guess it's just base aligned man coverage, I guess. I'm not really sure what to expect there. So I got to start thinking about this. Uh, if I could throw it up right now to Freddie B over there, Fred Bolitnikov, what do you got for me, Fred? Can I throw this up to you? Absolutely not because you don't have hands, huh? I feel like my players, you know, so far could perform a little bit better. That I, That's maybe just me. I'm interested. He's running a lot of zone coverage. This looks like a lot of zone coverage, even though he's got all man coverage abilities. I'm not really sure why. All right, we might go to Dave Casper on the pop pass. We're not going to Dave Casper on the pop pass. We're going to Freddie B. Come on, Freddie B. Get us the first down, Freddie B. Come on, keep it pushing, boys. Hurry to the line. We're just going right for it. We're going right for it right now. Right for it right now. All gas, no breaks. There's, there's our guy, Dave Casper. Guys, did we just get our first touchdown of the season? Looks like we did. Dave Casper over the middle. And finally, we have seven points. Finally. All right. We took a lead. This is our first lead of the season. Feels pretty good. Good job, Dave. Good job, Derek. All right. So we just audible to bunch. All right. And I like going against bunch. I feel like this defense I got going right here is great bunch defense. If he has Larry Fitz on a C route, which he absolutely does, then that would be a problem. Larry Fitz is actually the guy we really got to watch out for. I do have deep route KO, but that C route is going to smack us if, if he continues to run it. So we're going to blitz five here. Man, this guy with the audibles. He's got a lot of audibles in his arsenal. A lot of odds in the arse. In the arse. There we go, boys. All right. All right. Second and eight. Let's see what he's got. I should have an outside zone. There we go. We got nothing on the right sideline. I'm going to have to go over there and help myself. I'm all over that flat route. That's, that's a pick, right? Pick the damn ball off. 35. What the fuck is your problem? How many times are we going to see that same animation from 35? 35 doesn't want to win. I don't know why 35 keeps doing that, man. He keeps swatting the ball like that. Uh-oh, wide open. That's not wide open, is it? That's not wide open. He had the other... He had the slant, I think. He had the slant, I think. Fourth and eight. I'm very happy he missed that read. All right, fourth and eight, chat. All right, we're using Trayvon Merrick. That's probably not a good idea. Running back, running back, running back. Over the middle, over the middle, over the middle. Let's go. Was that Khalil Mack that came home? Khalil Mack, a little pressure on the quarterback. And now we are in the driver's seat, boys. We're going deep, my friends, all right? I think Tim Brown on the outside catches a streak. I think Tim Brown gets the ball no matter what right now, all right? We're throwing to Timmy, boy. Tim, don't let me down, Buster. Don't let me down, Tim. These kids can't catch. All right, well, I kind of want to keep throwing it to Tim Brown. I, I, I just feel like Tim Brown should be catching these passes. All right, Cliff Branch, get us a few yards. We're in field goal range. Worst case scenario, we get three right here. Chat, tell me I need to get Marcus Allen involved in the flat. I'm okay with doing that. Let's see if we can get Marcus Allen the ball. I lied. We're going to Freddie B. Fred Bolitnikov looks like a hippie, bro. He's got that long hair. I imagine Fred Bolitnikov likes to go on long bike rides on the beach to smoke weed. That, that's the vibe I'm getting from him. We know the pressure's going to be coming in hot. We know that. There we go! Timmy Brown in the end zone on the post route. Beat his man coverage. Very proud of the O-line for holding strong. We didn't block our running back. If we take a look at the replay here. We didn't block our running back, so I thought the pressure was going to kill us here. But we stepped up in the pocket. O-line held strong, and Tim Brown beat his man. Another touchdown. We're playing good today. Bo Jackson might be 99 speed. I don't think he is, though. <laughs> oh, man. Smith just smoked you, Abram. Abram! Get his ass! I'm sick of you! I'm sick of you, Jonathan Abram. All right, Jonathan Abram let us all down on that last play. Gave about a 40-yard corner route. Thank you, Jonathan, for that one. Uh, the entire city of Las Vegas thanks you, man. There's something coming on the backside. Post, 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 post. Come on! 35 might need to be cut. Jack Tatum is a liability out there in coverage. I mean, he's sitting in an inside quarter. The post is coming right to him. Jack Tatum, you're supposed to take heads off. That's why we hired you. That's why we pay you. 
That was pussyfoot and bullshit, is what that was, Jack. All right, boys, 110 to go get points. All right, we want seven. There's our guy, Marcus Allen. A little juke inside, Marcus. I love to see it. All right, Bo Jackson probably not hitting that juke. To the line, run the same play. If Marcus Allen is there, we're throwing that shit. If he's not there, he is there, though. So we're throwing that shit. To the line. One more time. To the line. Only a seven-second runoff. You'd love to see it. To the line, same play. See what we got. See what we got. There we go, Timmy. Took a big hit. We're going to call that first time out there. Tim Brown on that post route has been smoking the man coverage. So my opponent decides to stay in spinner. I know that at least that route I can rely on. This looks like this might be man press. All right. I see Tim Brown on the outside. I think that's where we're going to go. Tim Brown's got to beat the guy, right? Tim! He doesn't have a KO, Tim. You got to catch that. Uh, we're going to block our running back this time. All right. He's been, he's been blitzing heavy. There's our boy Dave Casper, and he's out of bounds. Save a timeout. We're inside the 10. He's been blitzing heavy, so realistically, if we uh, if we do block the pressure, we should have time to find the open read. It's just a matter of actually having to block my running back. I like sending my running back out on route, so I don't I don't like blocking him too much. I will say on that last play, good pocket from Derek Carr, right? It's very rare you see Derek Carr step into the pocket and uh, stand tall, deliver a laser. There's our boy Casper. Casper has been a big part of this offense so far. We get the touchdown we needed. We're getting the ball back in the second half. Things are going our way. All right. We're three for three on offensive drives so far this game. Last game, we couldn't say the same. And I might have just missed the extra point. Seabass does a miss. I forgot. All right, there we go, boys. Only a few seconds left in the half. I don't think he's going to call a timeout. Never mind. I'm okay with that. With five seconds left in the half, you can run with Kyler all you want. I'm not going to trip about it. I don't know what the hell I just called. This is the worst defense I've ever seen in my life. I just I just gave up a touchdown, didn't I? What the fuck, man? What the fuck, man? Lester Hayes? You're slow as shit, man. You're slow as shit, Lester. All right, so the person who's been open the most, honestly, has been Dave Casper over the middle. Let's see if he's open right here. He's not at all. But that is... I told y'all, Tim Brown on that post route is going to be money, right? We have, we're have 14 for 17 with three touchdowns. The blitz has been a little bit difficult to deal with, but I think right here uh, we should be able to pick it up with the play action. Good throw, Derek. Maybe get that ball off a little quicker next time. There's our guy right there, Dave Casper. Dave Casper, the ghost. I love Dave Casper. We're going to use and abuse him all day long. Dave Casper is our guy, and we're not going to change it. All right, we're in motion over Cliff Branch. We're looking for him on the corner route. If uh, Cliff Branch... We got to go to the flats. Marcus Allen, you're our guy. Come on, Marcus. Are you fucking kidding me? I mean, can I get more unlucky than that? Marcus Allen fumbles for six. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you kidding me, dude? I'm honestly the least lucky person alive. Like, I... I, I have no words for this. Marcus Allen fumbled. I, I'm sad now, guys. I, I don't know what to say. I'm, we're giving it right back to Marcus Allen. If he fumbles again, he's so cut. Like, you know, maybe I should plug in Bo Jackson. I, I don't think Bo Jackson fumbles there. Can we get Tim Brown on the outside. That's what I want. There we go, Tim. That's what I want. Tim, that's what I need, actually. Let's get in the end zone and take our lead back, man. We're losing now. We, we had a two-possession lead. We, we This has been a tough, tough go of it the last couple minutes of this game. But I'm not going to give up. We're not going to lose. There's Dave Casper. All right, keep it pushing. Keep it pushing. Could run the ball here. I probably should run the ball here. Mark Sound, do not fucking fumble. Don't fumble, Marcus. All right, we got Bo Jackson in now. I don't think Bo Jackson would fumble. I think Bo Jackson could potentially get outside, break a tackle, and get break two tackles to get in the end zone. Why are we not giving Bo Jackson the ball more, chat? Why are we not giving Bo Jackson the ball more? That's beautiful. All right, we take our lead back. Let's play a little defense here. Let's play a little defense right here. All right, first and 10. Let's see what he's got for us. Oh, a little handoff in. Oh, no. Centers almost took that one. I feel like there was a lot of space out in front of him. All right, second and three. He motions over Rondale Moore. That's who we're going to have to watch. Oh, it's a counter. My opponent looks like he might be trying to chew clock. 
Is my opponent trying to make this the last drive of the game? It might be the case. All right, boys. We got our defense set up the way we want it. We're going to shade outside. I don't want a C route on the outside from 82. That's the only thing I don't want. No C routes from 82. Good flat. Good flat. I had a hard flat. Wait, I have zone drops on, don't I? Oh, my God. I, my zone drops are on. My zone drops are on, and I didn't realize it. My opponent is trying to make this the last drive of the game. He's chewing clock heavy. There we go. There we go. All right. He had a couple things wide open. Uh, but this is definitely the last drive of the game. So we need to play defense here. No touchdowns. Corner route's wide open. Corner route's wide open. God dang it, dude. We're going to start calling our timeouts here soon. The 40-second play clock with four-minute quarters is really, really, really tough. I, I ran commit right there. Ran commit. There we go. That's what I thought. There we go, boys. There we fucking go. There we go. Third and 19. Wake up right now. Oh, no. Dude, I didn't get anything set up. All right. Fourth and seven. This is it right here. This is it. Bro, I can't get anything set up. Come on. I don't need to set it up. Come on. He hurried to the line. He tried to put his nuts on the table. It almost worked. It almost worked. Look at the replay here. Fourth and seven. We didn't even get any defense set up, but because he went so quick, he wasn't able to pick up the pressure. That was the difference maker for us right there. And now with a minute left, it, the ball's in our hands. With one minute left, boys, the ball is in our fucking hands, okay? He's got three timeouts. So it's, it's doable that he could get the ball back, but we're gonna give the ball to Bo Jackson. And you know what they say? They say Bo knows. Word on the street is that guy Bo, yeah, he knows. So let's go ahead and give him that rock, right? Let's go ahead and give him that rock, right? Break a damn tackle, Bo. I thought you knew. It's time to find out what just what Bo knows. What do you know, Bo? What do you know? Chad, do I go for this? I like it. Pin him, pin him at the 15, the 14. Pin him. Where are we? Where the fuck is our kick coverage? How did he... Where's our coverage? 39 seconds. All right, one opportunity for glory defense. Get the stop, get the win, and we walk out of here one and one. All right, we need this win to stay alive. We cannot go, we cannot fall to 0 and 2. If we do, our life as we know it in this league is fucking over. That's got to be a tackle inbounds. Inbounds, inbounds, come on! That's it! Namdi Asma with the huge tackle. He's going to Larry. He's going to Larry. It doesn't matter. 16 seconds, boys. 16 seconds. 16 seconds of the clock. We get him inbounds one more time. It's over. Inbounds one more time, and it's over. He wants Larry. He's not getting Larry. And, boys, we might have just sealed our victory. Our first victory of the season. Claps all around. Everybody cheer. One and one, boys. Great effort from the team. Great work all around. All right, Derek Carr had himself a hell of a game. 312 yards, three touchdowns, 83% completion percentage. And here we are, one and one. It feels so good.